There are new billboards up along Route 45, not far from the Foxconn and Oldium Cells plants. They're critical of the United Auto Workers Union, focusing on a corruption scandal last year. The billboards were put up a couple of weeks before Aldium workers are scheduled to vote on joining the UAW. With the story of the billboards, here's First News reporter Jacob Thompson. Fact, UAW is under federal oversight after a corruption scandal. That's what the billboard off Route 45 in Warren Township says. The union was part of this massive corruption scandal. Um, and so our take on it is that we think the public and workers uh, need to be aware of what the union went through and the consequences that it has for the union and its members. Charlize Bozello is the communications director for the Center for Union Facts located in Washington, D.C. They put up the billboard. This was a massive scandal. Several union officials went to jail, including two union presidents. According to an article by the New York Times, a federal investigation found widespread corruption, with many of the top leaders embezzling more than $1 million. The UAW has a history with Lordstown when GM was here, but the Center for Union Facts says that was not the reason for the billboard specifically. We do want to target places where we think the discussion and this kind of awareness is going to have the greatest impact. On Tuesday and Wednesday of next week, all team cell workers will vote if they want to join the UAW. I asked the National UAW for a response to the billboard. The union says it doesn't comment on ongoing organizing efforts. The Center for Union Facts says it has done this in other communities that have have had controversies with the union. Um, we try to target them in areas where we think we can add to the discussion that's kind of already percolating in the area. Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.